how would you manage the Fed and their what I believe is their over their overreach with raising interest rates, crushing the middle class right now, their ability to to even qualify yep. for a mortgage has become impossible at seven and a half percent interest rates. I know oh, the this is such a good question. I got I got I, I, I should probably rock and roll soon, but this is such a good question. Let me just take this at one too is. So here's the deal. The Fed has been for 25 years trying to hit two targets with one arrow, and they've been missing on both mm -hmm. inflation and unemployment. The reality is the Fed shouldn't be doing any of this playing financial God from on high. They should be focused on one job. Stabilize the U.S. dollar as a unit of measurement. Period against gold, silver, nickel, agricultural and farm commodities. That's it. Stabilize the dollar. It actually means something against goods of real value, commodities of real value. That's it. I don't need then 23,000 employees, which is how many work in that system today. I need less than 10% of that. So what are we doing? 90% headcount reduction at the U.S. Federal Reserve. Single mandate, stabilize the dollar. And this reveals part of the problem, actually. Because when you have a bunch of people who show up to work who shouldn't have had that job in the first place, it's not just their headcount costs that are the problem. Yeah. It's that they find things to do that actually are far more destructive than just having not existed in that bureaucracy in the first place. Plus, we'll save the headcount costs, too. That's the way I think about it. And it gives you a sense for how I look at you know, the FDA and the SEC and otherwise in a very similar light.